calling PayPal. This is Jesse. How may I help you? Um, Jesse, um, hi. Uh, good afternoon to you. I got um, a, a message um, and I don't know anything about it. Um, are you able to assist me um, or... You got a message or you got an email? Yes, so I said I got a message. It's for six hundred and forty nine dollars and eighty eight cents uh, for a PayPal payment, um, okay. and it's a, as I need support. Um, uh, I call you guys. May I have your first and last name? Yeah, it's Chester, and my last name is Draws. D R A W S. <laughs> Hello, you still there? Hello. Hello. Are you there with me? Uh, yes, I was. I oh, sorry. I thought the line was disconnected. Um, yes. All right. Well, let me just tell you one thing, sir, that uh, there was be some kind of suspicious attempts on your PayPal account. That's why we have sent you that message, that email regarding that PayPal charge. Yeah, but I don't have a PayPal account. Um, what, so someone's um, got my identity and created an account? Is that what you're saying? Uh, that's right. Oh, that's all I need. So, uh, have, have, they, have they got all my details? Was it just my name and the email address? Well, maybe all of your details, so we need to go ahead and check that. Okay, please, yes. Um, let me just go ahead and check, and I'll just give you a call back and let you know about this, okay? Okay. Um, can I give you another number to call me? Uh, this is my work phone. I'll give you my... my, no my so you... Uh, I'll give you my cell phone, uh, my private one. Uh, it's five one. Thank you for calling PayPal support. This is Daniel. How can I assist you? Daniel, hi. I was speaking to a colleague of yours, and I asked him to call me back on my private, uh, my personal cell phone, uh, but he hung up before taking a number. All right. Um, can I give you the number, and can you pass it on to him? Okay. Can you please provide me with the number? Yeah, five one eight six one six nine one five. Okay, and whom you were talking to? Um, oh, sorry, I forgot to, uh, I forgot to take his name down. Sorry, it's regarding um, okay. a, a payment six hundred and forty nine dollars and eighty eight cents. Um, your colleague said because I don't have a PayPal account, he thought my account had been um, or my identity had been stolen. And um, he he said he was going to check, uh, and I said, could he call me back? Not on this number because this is my um, my work cell phone, but my private cell phone. But he hung up before taking um, uh, the number. Okay, not a problem, sir. Uh, now, sir, what do we need to do? Uh, can you please verify me the charge? Like, is there is that charge is for Coinbase? It, it just says a PayPal of six hundred and forty nine dollars and eighty eight cents. Um, and uh, confirming the charges from Coinbase Global, right? Um, I don't know. It may be. I'm just doing this from memory. I've I've stepped right. out of the I've stepped out of the office. I didn't want anyone here in my business. Okay. Okay. Not a problem, sir. So what we can do best, sir? Yeah. We need to connect you to our security servers in order to check each and everything. And after that, we will dispute the charge and we will go for the cancellation of your PayPal account as well. Okay. That yes, will be please. Fine for you. Yes, please. Okay. Now, can you please tell me, do you have any laptop or cell phone handy with you? Any uh, yes. Do I yeah, connect it to the internet? Yes, I've just stepped out of the office. I'm in a coffee shop at the moment. Um, I've got my laptop with me. Okay. okay, your laptop is with you, right? Yes, it is. Okay, now do one thing, sir. Uh, is it turned on? It is, yes. Okay, now look at the... Now, can you please tell me the make and model of your laptop? It's uh, Apple or it's uh, no, Microsoft? It's uh, it's a Windows. It's a Hewlett Packard laptop. Oh, it's a Windows laptop. That's perfect. Okay. okay. Now look at the keyboard, the physical keyboard of your laptop at the left bottom. Yeah. You will see there a CTRL key. At the left bottom, do you see any CTRL key? Yes, I do. And just right to that, there will be a four flag key, Windows key. Do you see that? Uh, no, it's um, uh, uh, FN key. Uh, the... And right to the FN key, there will be a key which has four boxes on it. That's correct, yes. Okay, now you have to press that Windows key 
with the letter R at the same time. R as in Roger. Yeah. Um, okay, now what came up on your screen? Um, it's a little box on the um, left-hand side. Um, uh, type the name of a program folder. Okay. Sorry, okay. did you see? now you have to type in over there. Now you have to type in over there, www. Yep. Dot. Yep. U L T R A. Yep. V I E. Yep. W E R. Uh, ultra dot ultra viewer. It's ultra viewer dot net n e t net yep okay type that in uh, okay n e t yep. www dot ultra viewer dot net yep and what happens now do i uh, click ok or browse hit ok hit ok uh okay, called... now what comes up on your screen do you see yeah it's okay it's what comes to... up on your screen it's gone to a web page um oh Okay, now do you see ultra viewer in blue and black uh yes uh where's uh what's ultra viewer download document pricing blog contact tap on down tap on download yep uh download ultra viewer install exe portables yeah install install exe which is orange in color yep install that Okay, uh, it's it's downloading something. Okay, once you finish with download, just open that. Yeah, hang on. Okay, did you open that? I'm just doing it now. Hang on. Uh, ultra. Yep. Yeah. It says, uh, "Do you want to allow this app?" I take it it's yes. Uh, allow. Yes. Yeah, uh yes tap on yes go yep. with all the positive options you will get over there allow uh, install next finish. yeah it's preparing to it's installing now it's a green bar that's going across all right install yep okay yep once you see finish over there let me know yes this is extracting files uh the green bar is about three quarters of the way okay. through not a problem it says it's registering all right uh, uh, uh yeah finish tap on finish yeah it's a box that's just opened um it says okay, okay. now do you see your id over there yes i do uh, verify me the numbers read me out the numbers uh seven seven six eight nine uh nine five three okay and the password uh nine nine eight four nine okay now just give me a moment or just stay online okay um just give me a moment sir okay so just give me a moment so just bear with are me are you on that small box where you can see your id and the password no, I was just sorry. I was just uh, uh, closing something down. Uh, I can't see it. Hang on a moment. I just right. Yes. All right. All right, sir. Now close each and everything. Close this. Uh, close this task. It says your partner will not be able to reconnect after you close Ultra Viewer. Are you sure you want to exit Ultra Viewer? Okay. Tap on OK. Okay. Yeah. No, sir. Now open Ultra Viewer. Open Ultra Viewer again. Oh, you told me to close it. Can you please open that again? uh uh he, yeah the box is opened okay now i'm just okay now can you please provide me with the password um yeah zero two eight eight nine okay just give me a moment um my screen has gone black all right all right not a problem sure okay now can you please uh do one thing can you please open your google chrome yep okay now go and check your email. Like, do you got any email within the last seven days? My email? Yeah, but it's on my uh, phone. Yes. It's on my work phone. It's on your phone? Okay, you don't use your email here? No. Okay, can you please log into your email once? Uh, I'm logged into my email. 
on your uh, laptop, sir. That is the no, Solaris I... device you're using right now. No, uh, my phone is um, is my company uh, phone. Um, it's uh, secure. Oh, it's a secure, more secure. All right, okay. Now check for the last seven days email. Do you got any email, any suspicious email, like any lottery, any no. intellectual email? No, the only email I've got is uh, from yourselves. All right, not a problem, sir. Yeah. Okay, just give me a moment. Okay. Uh, my mouse is moving. Oh, your mouse is moving? Yeah, on the screen. Okay. Okay. No, sir. Uh, you told me you got a charge for uh, six hundred and forty nine dollars and eighty eight cents. Um, that's who I was. I was just checking on um, my bank. Um, nothing's gone through. Okay. Can you please check it again? Like check all of your bank statements for the last ten days. Like yeah. you got any charge for zero dollars some cents yeah, or one dollar some cents? Nope. Um, I just looked a few moments ago before I thought uh, I called you. Okay. The Wi-Fi here is really slow. Uh, oh, what, sir? The Wi-Fi here in the coffee shop is really slow. Okay, and can you please provide me with your uh, personal cell phone number again? Yeah, 518-616-1111. Okay, just give me a moment. Hello? Now, sir, check all of your bank. Yeah, I'm here, sir. Now, check all of your bank statements thoroughly. Like, do you got any charge for one dollar some cents or zero dollar some cents? No, I just looked at it earlier on, as I say, before calling you. Um, all right. Uh, it's not like the previous. Uh, nope. Okay, now, sir, just stay there. Uh, now, do one thing. Can you please uh, log out from your bank account? Okay, now do the Windows and R again, like you did before. Let okay. me run some scans about your network status to check your network status is uh, okay. running well or not. Okay, uh, I've done the Windows and R. Now type in over there CMD, Charlie Michael Delta. Okay, yep. Uh, it's a box. Now, you, do you see a cursor blinking? Yes. Okay, now do right. one thing. You have to type it over there, NETSAT, N-A-T-S-T-A-T. N-E-T-S. Okay. Okay, now this scan will show you about your network status. That yep. how many foreign addresses are connected to you, how many hackers are connected to you. Okay. Okay, now just stay there, okay? Do not touch anything. Okay. I'm holding your line for a minute. Stay online, okay? And okay. if I lost you, I'll give you a call back within a 60 seconds. Okay. Hello? Yes, sir, I'm still here. Just give me a moment, sir, okay? Stay online. Yeah, um, what was going on? Um, yeah, I'm working on your case. There's something that's just come up on my computer. It says, error opening rim joist EXE. Do you want to fix it? Just give me a moment, okay? Stay online. Should I, should, should I click yes? No, click no. Oh, someone's clicked it. Uh, it's a message saying unable to fix this error scanning the PC. Um, it okay, says, it says a virus detected while scanning this PC. Do you want to scan again? 
anything now. Uh, I'm not. Cl I'm not clicking on this. It, uh, it says anyway, virus. It says virus activated. It says abort, retry, or ignore, or hang up. Oh, it's a shame. Oh, you could tell me so. <laughs> Uh, you are a dirty beggar boy. No rupee for you today. Go wash lunch for your mother in GB Road. You are a Ben's hood. Ha ha ha. <laughs> and then you would have got this message if you'd um, bothered to stay on. Oh, they did disconnected everything. No wonder if I, they uh, just given their game away where they're actually based. Uh, oh, Pune in India. What a surprise. How can I help you? Yeah, hi. Um, I was speaking to someone uh, a short while ago. Um, are they available? Oh, you're loud. speaking to them. Don't call this number. We are done with you, man. Just fuck off. Oh, right. Yeah. Um, did you notice your uh, ultra view doesn't work anymore? <laughs> I wonder how long before it gets blocked. Hey, your yeah. ultra view yeah, is brother. your ultra view isn't working. Fuck off. Is that the best you can do? <laughs> oh, call him again. I think that's what he said. Seems that they don't want to uh, answer. Okay, bye for now. Um, I reported their any desk. I'm just going to end this call to uh, stop the noise. Uh, potty mouth is still trembling with fear. Um, I reported the uh, any desk, and I'll post the uh, link um, where if you do get uh, anyone trying to use uh, any desk, if you go to the uninstall so go to the start um, on your uh, computer go to add remove and then uh, uh, remove uh, ultra viewer it will come up with a web page asking you why you uh, uh, want to uh, uninstall the program and one of them is an option uh, I was uh, contacted by a scammer uh, and basically just follow the links but I'll include it in the description below Thanks everyone. Bye.